this is spreading out in the world person to person to person and it's traveling through spiritually awakened people this particle does not come from here and so in my view and understanding today this particle actually brought the blueprint of biological life to the planet and so it has been profoundly connected to our biology forever it's you could say been whispering to our bodies through our food for a long long time until our food got refined and one of the things that gets taken out of our food with refinement is polycosinol and a very small part of normal polycosinol is in this nano form and so when that got taken out this uh, metadicol or nanosoma whichever name you wish to give it was removed and lo and behold back it comes in the magic of this little product that Raghu has returned to the world really because it's described in the Rig Veda of 5600 years ago, the spiritual text. And so this is not new, uh, it's very old, in fact you might say older than biological life itself, coming forth now in this time and frankly its impact on our bodies is truly profound. It truly is like the missing key to the functioning of our bodies that we didn't know was missing. I will say here and now that this little product does not cure or treat anything. What it does is activates our body to take care of itself in ways we didn't imagine was possible. And so there is yet to be a pathological virus, bacteria, yeast or fungus that this has been tested against that it doesn't trigger the body to heal. There is no health condition this has been tested against that it doesn't trigger the body to heal. And it includes the ability to, to correct our DNA, which is fairly important in the time we are living through. You know, I just, I'm just so, I feel so honoured and blessed to have had this gift for humanity to come into my life. And I thank Raghu for his work in, in enabling that to be possible. I think people don't understand that in this world today, universe, there are 10, the number 10, followed by 32 zeros of viruses in this world today. What the bacteria and viruses do when you enter our body is they block the vitamin D receptor because that's the guy in chromosome 12 who is responsible for your innate immunity, body's first line of defense. Once they do that, there's no immunity. Then they start multiply. So what this guy does is basically goes and pushes them out of the way. He says, you don't belong here and allows the vitamin D to work, innate immunity. That's all it is. Very simple. My idea was instead of trying to hit, kill the virus or take care of a disease, why not let the body do the job? In 1997, I believe there was a lecture I attended at, uh, in New York Academy of Sciences. Uh, there was a gentleman by name, Dr. Feliz. He, he happened to have worked with a lot of uh, uh, nutritional supplements. At the end of the conversation, he made a comment which stuck in my head. He said, in his lifetime, there will be a simple product that will replace all drugs. That's exactly what he said. And everybody laughed. He said, he said don't laugh because it could turn out to be true. The, the elephants in India and more so in Southeast Asia, India. The, the, two the two favorite foods are sugar cane and rice. And elephants don't get cancer because they produce a gene called P53. They make four or five copies of that gene, which is an anti-tumor agent. So I said, well, why would the elephants eat sugar cane? And then the next clue came was that there ha happens to be a temple in India called Vaidishwaran. The translation means in South India, actually. Miss Doctor's Temple. People go there and worship. So what they do is they take the sugar cane. Sugar cane is, you cut the sugar cane, you squeeze the juice like you would crush grapes. You get a juice. Uh, you let the water evaporate in the sun and you get a brown piece of uh, uh, substance, which we call as jaggery. This temple, you go and worship with the jaggery and it's believed to cure 4,448 diseases. And the beauty of this is, Everything here is, is environmentally friendly, recycled. 
Every bit, water, of course, you know, our product grows all the time. Vitamin E is everywhere, ubiquitous. Citric acid is from lemon. I mean, how, so we fulfill the need for an environmentally safe product. It can be taken by anybody, including animals. The thing, the bottom line for me is Nanosoma doesn't care what the cause is. If it doesn't belong naturally in the body, it gets cleared. Is it a virus? Is it a bacteria? Is it a man-made virus? It doesn't care. Is it, there's certainly significant evidence to suggest that these so-called vaccines, which cannot be vaccines be, at the very least because of how long it took to supposedly develop them, um, it, doesn't, it doesn't really matter ultimately because all of this stuff doesn't belong in the body and nanosoma activates the body to clear everything that doesn't belong heavy metals herbicides pesticides what about these spike proteins uh that them too that too gone secondly just two days ago i had a text from a man who has become an enthusiastic user of the product he said oh by the way do you know your product clears the um spike protein that's being shedded. I said, we believed so. Why do you say so? He said, well, my daughter came into contact with somebody who'd been vaccinated and she became very ill with this. And uh, I insisted she used a nanosoma. It was cleared very quickly. What happens when you begin to use this product is the body uh, in conjunction, in the presence of this product conduct, conducts a triage. And whatever is life-threatening gets fixed pretty much immediately. And other things follow along behind. So we got thousand times the result. Things that we didn't expect. No? Thyroid disease, liver disease, hypertension, asthma, uh, people's hair growing back, people's hormones getting balanced, people's women's periods getting normalized. All these things, there's so many things. Like I'm not shocked anymore. The way we are talking here, uh, it begins to sound like there's almost nothing that it can't cure. Uh, so what it, it does is trigger the body to, to clear itself. It makes the body aware. I think that's the best way to right. look at it. Okay. It makes the body aware of everything that is abnormal that doesn't belong. So when Raghu talks about this plugging into the software of the body, as he said, the 48 nuclear receptors, it's regulating all of them from his work. This is truly profound. Resetting the whole body on pretty much every level and including reversing the aging process. I published that paper on arthritis where this guy has the bones of a 65 year old. He starts using my product after 18 months. He has the bones of a 35 year old. Right now, there's a lot of people who have suffered from depression in the situation that we're in in the planet. Mm -hmm. So um, it's your do you think that it, it affects uh, it sounds like if it affects your energy, it probably affects Absolutely. depression. Mm -hmm. It will. This particle is both conscious and intelligent. There's no question about it. And uh, one of the things Raghu says interestingly is this product chooses the people it will go out into the world through. He's been watching it for 10 years. My vision is that in 20 years time, humanity will look back and wonder how it was. We walked through this time of illness and disease and aging because it won't exist anymore. Nanosoma is a natural food supplement. This nutritional supplement supports the body's healing mechanism to heal itself.